In this video, I have compiled a list of the top 5 best ice augers in the market that are worth buying. So let's get started. Number 5 Mo's 40cc propane auger was designed from the ground up for this fuel type. This is evident in its performance, and plenty of ice anglers are making the move easy to use propane as a result. Fueled by 1 pound propane bottles, there's no mess and no hassle. But given how efficient this engine is, a single bottle is more than enough for a day on the ice, and you'll have no trouble drilling dozens and dozens of holes before switching tanks. This Eskimo uses chipper blades, and they bite the ice with appetite. Head to head, we're not sure this propane auger is slower or less powerful than the 44cc gasoline model, and that should dispel any doubts about propane augers being outgunned on the ice. One thing we really like about this auger is that it's easy to start and reliable in very cold temps. No priming, no choking, just go. And because propane burns with no emissions, you can use this auger in your shelter. Number 4 Nils convertible auger is essentially the excellent high velocity hand auger with a few modifications. While the business end is the same, you can remove the handle and attach a drill via a one half inch chuck. Like the K drill, you'll need a beefy, high torque motor to drive these blades into the ice and Nils recommends that your drill can generate no less than 700 inch pounds of torque. Nils blades are simply excellent, and this auger will bite the ice like it's starving. No downward pressure is needed at all, the blades will grab the ice and get to work immediately. Not everything is perfect, however, and this auger can slip free of the chuck while drilling. It's saved from the water beneath the ice by a flare disc above the blade that's wider than the whole diameter so you don't need to worry about losing your auger. Finally, the Nils is so fast by hand that it's not clear if much is gained by adding a drill to the picture. But at the very least, the handles provide a backup plan in case your drill or battery fails. Like the K-Drill system, expect a combined weight in the neighborhood of 10 pounds. Number 3 the most important part of any hand auger is blade sharpness, and the Strike Master Ice Auger's Laser Hand Auger has razor sharp chrome alloy stainless steel blades that will drill into hard ice. Powder coated paint helps reduce ice buildup and keeps the auger working like it should. An adjustable 48 to 57 inch handle ensures that the auger is easy to use regardless of how tall you are and how deep the ice is. Soft rubber grips allow you to really crank. The 7-inch width creates holes big enough to handle most trout and panfish, but isn't too big to make drilling holes overly difficult. Hand augers are slower and less powerful than gas and propane augers. And, of course, you have to put some good old-fashioned sweat into drilling a hole. So if you're not willing to put in the time and effort to drill holes by hand, or if your ice is 12 inches or thicker, invest in a gas-powered auger. Gas-powered augers can be pricey, and they require buying and toting fuel. They require maintenance to make sure that they start easily and run well. They're also heavy. But if you ice fish often, are drilling through thick ice, or want to drill wide enough holes for big lake trout and pike, then a gas-powered auger is a must. Number 2 Strike Master's electric auger is an amazing performer, often out drilling gas and propane powered rivals. Available in 8 inch and 10 inch diameters and tipped with sharp chipper blades, this auger loves to eat ice. A pilot spike helps you get started, preventing the blade from wandering, and once it starts to bite, the hole is practically done. At least as fast as any powered auger we've seen, you lose nothing but weight and mess by moving to this battery powered system. Batteries hate the cold, so to conserve their power, you need to keep them warm. Simply tossing them in a small cooler with a hand warmer or two will do the trick, and we strongly recommend you take this precaution. If you do, several dozen holes in thick ice won't even begin to test the batteries on this lugger. A great design feature is a reverse gear that helps you clear slush from the hole, 
something we really like about this model. Like all electric augers, the Stroke Master is quiet and emission free, allowing you to use it inside your shelter. This isn't the lightest system with the battery installed, and the quoted weights don't include that figure. Ready to cut, these augers are a tad lighter than gas powered alternatives, but not by much. Number 1 Eskimos HC40 brings all the advantages of a propane powered ice auger to bear. The fuel comes in quick release canisters that are easy to find and avoids the messy complexity of using gas with a quieter than average engine. And since it burns clean, you can also use the HC40 in a shack. The four cylinder 40cc Viper engine kicks on reliably via the metal grip starter handle and is powerful enough to cut through the most stubborn and thickest ice. A centering ring also makes it easy to use for re drilling. Plus, it weighs a manageable 28 pounds, light enough to haul it on the ice, though perhaps a bit much for a longer hike to your target fishing spot. Shoppers appreciate that this model is easy to use and provides great value for the price. This is the auger for a true lover of ice fishing who plans to make the most of the season. While you'll need to pack fuel, the frustration and fatigue factors will be eliminated with this reliable, clean burning option. Thanks for watching guys, that's all for now I hope you guys liked this video, if this video is helpful to you, please make sure to like comment and subscribe, hope to see you guys in the next video.